G'day YouTube, today I'm going to show you how to extract a tar.bz2 file as uh, just like the one you can see right there. Now what you need to do is open it up via a terminal, Control alt t You have to actually navigate to where it is, so of course as I can see it there it's on the desktop. So I'll type in cd squiggly desktop to get me to the desktop in a shortcut manner sort of a fashion with that squiggly. Then from that point you want to type in tar, then dash, jxvf. Now I'll explain these. Uh, the dash, well the j flag here stands for uh, bzip2 file, which is the tar.bz2 file. For every uh, bz2 file you do have to specify j. Now x next to long just means extract. So pretty much anything you extract you're always going to use x. Uh, v stands for verbose, which is just a lovely technical term, which means um, that uh, it just you just want to see the output of what's going on. Always handy to have. And last but not least, F, which means turn it into a into an actual you know set of files and directories, unlike a test version of um, extracting. So J X V F, and it's usually in that format too. You might ask, uh, why isn't it necessarily in uh, alphabetical order? But uh, I always see it like that, and I get used to it like that too. Um, but I guess it's up to you guys. And then after that, another space. And in this case, mine is called autoconfig uh, 2.68 tar.bz2. I'll just stretch that out a bit. And I'll hit enter. And as you can see, all the output there. Uh, that's because of the verbose mode. And you can see it's extracted to the desktop as well. So that's pretty much it guys, that's how you extract a uh, bzip tar, uh, a tar.bz2, otherwise known as a bzip2 tar. Cheers guys.